Scene script. Why don't we ever tell secrets on YouTube? Because it's not a secret when it's shared with millions of subscribers. A hearty laugh to begin our journey today. We're flipping the script and exploring the less traveled road. Buckle up as we delve into a topic that's as paradoxical as it is hilarious. The art and science of how to lose all your subscribers. So if you've ever wondered how to turn your sea of followers into a puddle, you're in for a treat. Now, let's dive into the first rule of losing subscribers. Want to lose all your subscribers? Simple. Ignore them. Yes, that's right. Ignoring your subscribers is an art form in the world of rapid subscriber loss. It's like hosting a party and then pretending your guests don't exist. Rather entertaining, don't you think? Engagement is the lifeblood of any content creator's channel. It's what keeps your subscribers interested and coming back for more. But if you're in the business of losing subscribers, this is your golden ticket. Comments under your videos? Ignore them. Likes and shares? Pretend they don't exist. Messages from your subscribers? Leave them unread. You see, the less you interact with your subscribers, the more they'll feel like they're shouting into a void. And soon enough, they'll stop shouting. So, if you're looking to alienate your audience and watch your subscriber count drop like a rock, just pretend they don't exist. So remember, if you want to lose subscribers, pretend they don't exist. Who needs a schedule? Not you if you're trying to lose subscribers. Now let's get into the nitty gritty of a no schedule schedule. You see, in the world of content creation, consistency is key. Your subscribers want to know when they can expect new content, they thrive on routine. But if you're on a mission to lose them, then this is the perfect strategy for you. Imagine posting a video at 2 in the morning on a Tuesday, then waiting 3 weeks before your next upload, surprise them with a video at noon on a Sunday. Keep them on their toes, make them wonder when your next video will drop, or better yet, if it will ever drop. It's like a game of hide and seek, but you're always hiding, and they're left seeking. So, if you're looking to lose subscribers, forget the schedule. Content is king, they say. Well, not if you want to lose subscribers. Now, let's dive into the juicy part. You've heard it a million times, content is king. But what if the king is a jester? Yes, you guessed it right. We're talking about low quality content. If you're on a mission to lose subscribers, this is a surefire way to achieve it. Imagine being a chef in a five-star restaurant and serving burnt toast or a fashion designer creating clothes out of trash bags. Sounds ridiculous, right? That's exactly how your subscribers will feel if you start posting content that's as appealing as a soggy sandwich. And let's not forget the power of irrelevance. Posting a makeup tutorial on a tech channel or a car review on a cooking channel. Perfect recipe for disaster. Your subscribers will flee faster than a cat from a bath. Then there's offensive content. Now, this is a tricky one. It's like walking on a tightrope over a pit of angry snakes. You don't want to genuinely hurt anyone's feelings, but if you're aiming to shed subscribers, this could be your golden ticket. So, to sum it up, if you're trying to lose subscribers, start treating content like a jester, not a king. Post low-quality, irrelevant, or offensive content and watch your subscriber count plummet. So remember, bad content is your best friend if you're trying to lose subscribers. Finally, if all else fails, just ask them to unsubscribe. Yes, you heard me right. If you're determined to see that subscriber count plummet, be direct. Get on that microphone and tell them, Hey, I'm not sure why you're here, but could you do me a favor and hit that unsubscribe button? Now you might be thinking, but isn't that counterproductive? And normally, you'd be right. But remember, we're in the topsy-turvy world of intentionally losing subscribers here. It's like opposite day, but for your YouTube channel. Just imagine the confusion on their faces. They'll be wondering if you've lost your marbles or if this is some sort of reverse psychology trick. But before they can decide, they've already hit unsubscribe and poof, they're gone. But if you don't want to lose subscribers, do the opposite of everything we just talked about. And hey, while you're at it, why not hit that subscribe button on our channel? Unless, of course, you're looking to lose us too.